Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So you already know by the title, this is a Target haul. Y'all know I love to shop at Target. And I just want to show you guys some things that I get all the time. Some things that I be getting when I go to Target. And that, yeah, hopefully I can put you on to some stuff. Or if y'all have tried some stuff that I'm getting, then let me know what you think in the comments. If you like these type of haul videos from target and like other stores and i can definitely do some more and let's just get right into it i had ran out of my previous witch hazel which was just like a regular witch hazel from like walmart and so now that i'm done with that one time to move on to bigger and better things and i've been having my eye on this one so very very excited that i finally found a jade roller at target and this is by Plum Beauty. It is a rose quartz facial roller. A J roller. Cute. It's marble. It's pink. Like a pink little marble. So yeah, you put these in the refrigerator and get them really cold. And it's really good to like wake your face up. And you can roll um, it on your face when you put a mask on or any type of serum with your skincare. Definitely look up the um, benefits of a jade roller and definitely invest in one. Okay, and also I got some Vaseline. This is just for my makeup looks when I'm dealing with color. Y'all are going to see that when y'all tune into my makeup tutorials. How Vaseline is going to help me clear my, clean my crease really well. <clears throat> And then I also got these sheets by Room Essential. I love these sheets. You guys, when I tell you these sheets are so soft, like literally your, your bed is literally going to feel like heaven. And it comes with a like regular sheet, you know, the sheet that you put on the mattress in two pillowcases. I have one in gray. Now I came back for the tan one. I'm going to get all colors. I think I want to get like the blue one. And they have like white. Yes, girl. Okay. And now I'm going to show you guys some more stuff that I get. Target. We're going to start off with the. I get these dragon fruit chunks. I love these to put in my smoothies. I make a lot of smoothies. These are bomb AF. But um, you also have to get them. You got to catch these because, baby, they be buying these up. Like, these be out of stock all the time. So, you got to really find them. If you have a Target that always has them or that has a lot in stock, then you winning <laughs> because my targets be so that when I find them, I'll be like, oh my gosh, like I, I be having to get like a lot of them, like stock up on them when I do see them because these bad boys go fast. Also, get they didn't have any mango chunks, but I all I already had mango chunks in my freezer so i just wanted to show you guys because i do get these from target as well i like to eat these like in like in a bowl frozen and i also like to put these in my smoothies as well because i am the smoothie queen if you follow me on instagram follow me on instagram stop right now follow me on instagram so i always y'all see that i be making a lot of smoothies i'll be putting mangoes in my smoothies as well that's for the fruit and I also picked up some micellar water it looks wet because it's from the dragon fruit but I picked up some micellar water I like this to take off my makeup and it says if you will focus removes makeup even waterproof mascara cleanses and soothes 
I feel like this stuff really gets my makeup all the way off, especially like with mascara and things like that. Like it really takes off all of my makeup. I would definitely recommend this my cellular water if you already don't use it. I use it after my makeup wipes because I mean makeup wipes. I use about like two makeup wipes, but you would think that all the makeup comes off, but it really doesn't. But it really doesn't. But with this stuff, I feel like it really takes away everything. So I love this stuff. Had to get some more. And also, um, if you have not already seen my new video, my which is my last video by the time this come up, um, on my wig, then go watch that. I picked up some more of this Garnier Fructis Sleek and Shine shampoo with vitamin E and argan oil. I always use this shampoo and I also have this conditioner they have the two for one at Target but I already have the conditioner and a lot of it so I only got the shampoo because I was out of the shampoo this is what I use on my weave when I wear weave wigs whatever this is the shampoo and I would and I use their conditioner this stuff smells so freaking good a little ASMR <laughs> okay, oh, it smells so good. Okay, yeah. Garnier Fruities. What else? <laughs> okay, and then I also picked up some concealer, this e.l.f. camo concealer. Um, I've been hearing a lot of good things. The girls, the makeup girls, been talking, and I heard this concealer is T and if you know about Tarte Shape Tape Concealer they said this is a dupe for it and I love Shape Tape Concealer by Tarte so I wanted to give this a try six dollars why not I got the shade Tan Sand that's the shade that I am in in um the Shape Tape Concealer by Tarte so I just got this one too <laughs> And then I also picked up another foundation, L'Oreal's Infallible Foundation. I have this already, but I have it in another shade that is too light. So I got this shade, cause and hopefully it'll be my shade or push come to shove, which is really what I plan to do from the beginning, is really mix the shades. Cause that's how you're gonna get your best coverage. It's very rare that you will find your exact match when it comes to foundation so nine times out of ten you're gonna have to mix to get you, if you want to get your perfect shade or otherwise it's gonna be a little off most times i don't mind it being a little off but that was way too light especially once i put on my concealer and stuff i'm gonna show y'all the i don't i did not remember the shade that i got before and i got the other one from ulta so hold on let me go see okay I have 486. It does not tell me the name. That's so dumb. How do y'all not tell the person the name? 486. Okay, toasted almond. Wait a minute. <laughs> Whoa, I had got toasted almond and this was way too light. That's crazy. Um, so I went back and I got Honey Bisque. That's in the shade 500. They are noticeably, I mean, in person, they are a little noticeably different. I just hope this um, Honey Bisque is not orange undertone. It seems like it wouldn't be, but I don't know. I feel like this one is a little more golden undertone, which is what I am. But it's just too light. Like, once I would put my concealer on and stuff, it would not have looked good. I bought this for... I was going to do a photo shoot for my birthday. And I bought this as a prop. But now, I did not. I didn't end up doing the photo shoot, so I don't know what to do with this. I feel like I, I think it's too late to take it back. And I said I would probably put like bananas like in here, like fruit, and then like put it on my island. But I don't know if that would be like too much. Like, what do y'all think? Like, should I put 
fruit in this or and put it on my island or is this just like too much i just need to i feel like eventually i am gonna do the shoot like just because but i mean i don't want this to go to waste so i don't know i guess i'm just gonna have to see what do y'all think let me know in the comments i also got these Bior strips from target if you seen my at home facial i will link that below if you want to do an at home facial i'm going to link that video below i use these and i rave about these i love these these are the goat when it comes to really deep cleansing and getting all of those pores out of your nose and your forehead i just got the nose strips because i always get the nose strips in the um the nose strips in the forehead strips but i always just end up using the nose strips and i still have more of the fake of the forehead strips so i got these bins for my hair products inside of my um inside of my closet that is in my bathroom so i can really be organized with my hair products because i have quite a few hair products and I just have them in this bag, like in this big bucket, and they're just everywhere, and I can never find anything. So, yeah, I got this big one for hair products, and then this one for like I think I'm gonna do like probably like combs, you know, like edge brushes, brushes, little, you know, little small little things like that. Okay, and yeah. I had some Kool-Aid pickles and they wasted in the bag. So I don't even know what this receipt is. I think the receipt is in the bag. But I think these was like $4 and $6 or $6 and $4. These face masks from Target. I just got this one because it's Jade. It's my name. It's supposed to balance, soothe, balance my mind and soothe my skin gemstone therapy aromatherapy skin therapy color therapy and it's made with a jade stone powder i get these a lot i really like these by q bella it's the aloe vera cream mask aloe vera is really good for your skin so i really like this one enriched with aloe vera tea tree oil and witch hazel all very good for your skin and clearing your face it's a cleansing mask so it's really gonna deep clean and get in there i like these my face feels really soft and just refreshed after i use these and you can get about like two to three uses out of this you don't have to use all of it it doesn't take all of this so yeah i love these i think these are about like 2.99 this one it's uh moisturizing firming and lifting i just do this with my skin just needs some extra hydration and my skin just really needs like a, a good boost i love this mask it's a sheet mask as well very moisturizing anything pomegranate y'all know i love it this is something that I always buy from Target. It is the Dove Exfoliating Body Polish. I love this stuff. Like, it's the go. Literally, it's the go. I love exfoliating with this. You're supposed to exfoliate your body like two to three times a week. And I love this stuff. Um, it smells so amazing. Like I told y'all, anything pomegranate. Are y'all seeing the trend here? Anything pomegranate I love, like I'm gonna get it because pomegranate is just top tier, very superior. It's really good to exfoliate before you get a wax, like the night before or like two nights before um, to exfoliate before you get a wax and also exfoliate after your waxes. Really great, love this stuff. Okay, another thing that I got, and y'all, this stuff is wet because I had to wipe it off. I had got some Kool-Aid pickles from my mama, and I put it, put the pickles in my Target bag when I brought out my bags in, which I knew was a mistake, and I did it anyway. So that's why all this stuff is wet because the Kool-Aid. I got another shower curtain liner, just a plain one to put, um, you know, the little clear part that you put in your shower. Duh. Uh, I just got another one of these because it's just time to switch my old one out. 
That was about $2.99 from Room Essentials. And I am super excited about this next product because I've been on the hunt. Da -da -da. Oh, what? The Honey Pot Normal Foaming Wash. This is their cleanser. Um, honey Pot is black owned honey so and the, it is for it is a feminine wash because as you know you're not supposed to use regular soap down there so a feminine wash would be the best option so i'm super excited to try the honey pot black owned support your black owned businesses and it she is in target so hey that's a win-win right there we love a good black owned business in target in target so yes this is their um foam and wash they also have one for sensitive skin i don't have sensitive skin I thought about getting the one for sensitive skin since it is down there, but it's like, I don't have sensitive skin, so, I mean, I just got the normal one. So it's a plant-based feminine care, no parabens, no deox deoxides, 100% um, net, I, my camera is not focused. 100% natural, cruelty-free, sulfate-free, plant-based, I love that made by humans with oh i like this one made by humans with vaginas for humans with vaginas okay black women made this this is not something that a man made this is a woman's product made by a woman by a black woman at that in target you gotta get it and these be so like i've looked in so many targets for these and i finally found it so i really had to cop it they also have like wipes and other feminine products like sprays and stuff like that other feminine products that you can buy but i really just wanted uh to try the feminine wash because i already have wipes but when i run out of my wipes that i already have i'm definitely gonna go pick me up some from the honey pot okay period let's get us some more black owned brands in target that's great we love that but yeah honey pop super excited to try this you guys and if you haven't tried it try it or if you have tried it let me know in the comments what you think about it and i'm going to show you guys a before and after of my closet in my bathroom um before i organize and after i organize just to give you guys a little bonus okay you guys so this is what it looks like before i know it looks so crazy it's a whole bunch of junk this is what i mean like how how like bro i have to go like in here and just like find stuff like me down so what i'm going to do is i'm just going to organize it i'm going to show you guys the after this is just the before so crazy i mean don't judge me <laughs> but i'll see you guys after i organize and here's the after of the organization in my bathroom closet. So here um, in the big bin, I put all of my like shampoos, everything, like hairsprays, all of like the big items and things like that. And then in the smaller bin, I put like hair dyes, waxes, hair oils, hair like smaller hairsprays. I put my, I put it down so I can see better. I put my combs on the side. It's a lot of combs down there. And I put like my little butterfly clips. Also all of my butterfly clips to do when I just want to, you know, pin my hair because I can never find a clip to pin up my hair. And also scrunchies. I can never find a scrunchie when they're in this big tube full of junk. So I put them like right here. My edge control, hair, more hair pins and things like that. And then in here in the big bin, I just put like, of course, these brushes that cannot fit in there. Obviously, my flexi rise and all of my hot tools like my hot my hot comb blow dryer one curl flatter and things like that and then just other like hair products in here accessories that could not fit in these bins and i like it because it's so much more organized i love being able to just see 
like comment share and subscribe and i will see you guys in my next one